different from what I usually paint, mainly because the subject doesn't exist in real life. She's a fictional character from the game League of Legends. Another reason is the method by which I'm painting. You can see I'm working in details in small areas at a time, and this is not how I usually paint. Normally, I create paintings with a gradual layering process, bringing the image forward layer by layer and leaving the details for the very end. With this piece, I'm actually putting in as much detail as possible with the very first color layer and working in small sections at a time. I don't really paint like this anymore. I used to when I was much earlier in my journey with oils, and eventually I just developed a preference for that gradual layering process. It's entirely personal preference and up to each artist to choose how they like to paint. However, when it comes to tight deadlines, I don't exactly have time to wait around for layers to dry, so I usually try and pack in as much detail with layer one and then the final touch-ups in layer two. This painting is a commission for Riot Games to celebrate the launch of the game Wild Rift. I was asked to paint a more realistic portrait of the character Jinx, and she will also be in Wild Rift. Her character is a bit of a psycho, but in a fun way, and since she doesn't exist, I couldn't exactly just call her up and ask her to drop by the studio so I can take some reference photos. That would have been massively convenient, but sadly impossible. So I created the image based on the cartoon style and animated portrayals of her. I spent a few weeks digitally composing the draft for the painting, essentially Frankensteining a variety of photos combined with digitally drawing and manipulating the image until I reached the composition I wanted to paint. I then used that same digital mock-up as the reference for the painting. I love using digital mediums to plan my oil paintings because it gives you the ability to make major changes in a very short time, which would not be possible to do that quickly with fine art materials. And of course, you don't have to worry about wasting anything during that drafting process, but I'm not ever satisfied with just leaving the art as a JPEG or a PNG or whatever. I need it to be a physical work of art, which is why I love oil painting and I don't think I could be a digital artist. I need that physical aspect to creating art. I think my favorite thing to paint was her taser, which you can also use in the game, but I really enjoyed painting the soft, cool, glowing light, and in general, I just love painting lights and glowing objects. I find the process of creating that illusion of the direct light source to be particularly enjoyable. This was a challenging painting, I must admit, definitely in creating the composition using imagination, which I don't do a whole lot of, but honestly it made me want to make more imaginative pieces using that method, and I'm excited to see how it goes in my future paintings. So, huge thank you to Riot Games for supporting my art and my channel. League is actually my husband's favorite game, so this commission is quite special for us. And at this point in the process, I'm adding my final touch-ups to the painting and really just finishing it all up. This is the finished painting.